Hey guys, this is Ashwin here. In this video, we are going to see about GPT-3 and its applications with the help of OpenAI. So I just uh, recently uh, got access to GPT-3 and I am also waiting for OpenAI Codex access. So OpenAI Codex access means uh, you can able to uh, use natural language to generate a code. So that is like a big milestone uh, we have achieved so far. Now here uh, we have access to GPT-3. Uh, so we are going to use natural language for using some uh, applications. So we have introduction examples and playground. We will just directly go into the playground and uh, explore the API, how it works. We have like numerous number of uh, examples uh, based on text. So it can be a classification, it, it can be code correction. There are so many applications are there. Now let's jump into the playground. So now we have to load some application. So we have chat, Q&A, grammatical, standard English, text to command, summarization, translation like English to French like that we can able to translate to some other language, parse unstructured data and we have classification. Apart from that uh, we have more examples we can able to use uh, with the help of OpenAI. Now let's go for the chat application. We will just explore few applications and see what it's capable of and uh, how it's uh, performing well. And after exploring few things, we can able to explore other examples like what all they are offering for this application. Now let's go into the chat. So we have few things here. So the following is a conversation with an AI assistant. The assistant is helpful, creative, clever, and uh, very friendly. We have some example like the human is asking, hello, who are you? I am an AI created by OpenAI. How can I help you today? Now we can uh, ask some questions about this uh, AI, or we can also have like a general conversation. So we will ask, which programming language do you use? Okay. Now we can able to submit and uh, get the result. So it's using Python 3. Let's see what is the meaning of life. This is some philosophical question. Let's see how it reacts. I do not know. Like it's like a common answer. I have uh, asked the same question in Q&A. Maybe we will do that. And what else? How things going? Not good. I have been sitting here alone since I was created. I wish I had a friend. Let's continue the conversation uh, as like a friend. So I can be your friend. Let's see how it reacts. I would like that. I think it's also capturing the previous uh, statements. Uh, based on that, it's uh, trying to figure out what's the best possible answer uh, it can able to give. So what else can we ask? So popular YouTube channels but it's like a normal statement let's see they are and yeah it's like a, some bug I don't know maybe I am we are not uh, mentioning the text properly so this is related to chat I think uh, you can able to uh, integrate few things and uh, make it some custom chat uh, like uh, for customer service or uh, any other services you can able to use this chat API and I also forgot to mention we have uh, different types of engine for the open AI so we have DaVinci, Curie, Babbage and Ada so each one is capable of uh, doing some particular task so here uh, DaVinci is like a most powerful one and Ada is like the most fast one so here uh, you can able to see like 
Query means language translation, complex classification, sentiment analysis, summarization. So here uh, sentiment search, moderate classification. So for each model engine, we can able to apply it for uh, different uh, examples. So if you are going to use uh, summarization means you can able to go for Query and uh, you can also go for uh, DaVinci if it's like a complex intent and uh, cause and effect summarization for audience if it's related to this examples means you can able to use the particular model like that you can able to use the model correspondingly I am just using DaVinci and here we have instruct so instruct is nothing but uh, here we have like predefined API if you want to customize few things means you can able to use this instruct to customize some attributes so that is uh, instruct maybe I will create a project uh, how to use this instruct and uh, develop some application in the future video now let's go for next application so I'm just going to uh, see Q&A and uh, English to French and classification so these are the examples I'm going to uh, see let's go for uh, Q&A so yeah, I already asked what is the meaning of life it said nothing so here I will ask what is the meaning of life so the meaning of life is to live how to live the life to live the life you must live <laughs> like I don't know what's the meaning of this it's like circulating the same meaning I will ask some common question how to become rich to become rich you must be rich I think it's just uh, uh, collecting some data and just uh, trying to match the word so it's not producing that much good results for these things I think this one is good and here they have asked question how does a telescope work maybe uh, we will just ask some general uh, questions what is AI AI is artificial intelligence and I will increase the response length to 500 so based on this length only it's generating this uh, sentences again let's try this okay it's just uh, showing the same information maybe we will ask some other thing what is wikipedia wikipedia is a free online encyclopedia so like that uh, we can able to ask some general questions and it's it will give you some answers so here also they have asked few questions and if it didn't know the answer means like how many uh, squigs are in a bonk means uh, it's I don't know what the question means but uh, they can't answer so it just replied it as uh, unknown here also what is the square root of banana it's also a meaningless question so it just replied it as unknown so this is the Q&A application next we will go for uh, English to French so this is some French I really don't know French let's try some words so how are you comment all your words <laughs> okay so yeah I can't able to pronounce uh, the French language but uh, the intention is clear we are just converting the English language to some other language here it is French and I think we can able to use that uh, instruct engine to translate to other uh, languages also so that is pretty much helpful let's go for classification okay here based on the company or some meaning of the word it just uh, classified uh, the industry and what segment it is about so here Facebook is social media technology LinkedIn is social media technology enterprise carrier and FedEx what is FedEx logistic transportation so it's automatically getting this data so let's ask about uh, military military 
submit defend security aerospace so it's automatically getting based on the word it's automatically classifying it some segments uh, let's say server cloud technology it's automatically uh, mentioned it as serverless so I didn't do that maybe I have to change something let's increase the response length and uh, say food so food beverage restaurant say so just automatically tagging the word maybe if you have some description means you can able to use this to automatically give taglines for that particular issues or uh, description it can be anything you you can able to automatically uh, tag some information so here it is a single word you can also customize it if you want so these are some common example we can able to do it uh, with gpt3 let's see some more examples what are the types of examples we have so this is the list of examples uh, we have from openai and some of the examples are uh, related to openai codex so that is related to uh, code generation from natural language so that is pretty interesting so here we can able to convert javascript to python so this is related to code here also we have python bug fixer so it will so it will help many people uh, for uh, debug the code even uh, normally it will automatically fix the bug that's the main point we, it's not like finding the bug it's automatically fixing the bug also so here we have time complexity and we can able to convert the python uh, code into some natural language explanation here we have translation text to command what other interesting uh, examples we have we have tweet ca classifier we don't have to cre create a model it just automatically classifies the information and uh, we have friendly chat like a uh, chat application javascript online function so it will just uh, convert the whole javascript into a one liner function essay outline here uh, i think i have seen some uh, pretty interesting examples so i'm just trying to search that i think i have uh, found it like ad generation maybe i will just uh, search for it advanced street see ad from product description so if you give a product description it will automatically uh, show you some uh, advertisement text from the description itself so you don't have to hire someone to create an ad so it will be very easy you just have to target the audience like you want to play some google ads means you just have to mention it and uh, say you want to uh, create an ad for some product it will automatically create an ad for uh, three to four lines it depends on your response length and it will create an ad so like this so like this uh, it has like plethora of use cases it also have like explaining the code i don't know i can't like uh, explore everything it's just uh, so amazing and uh, it is so open source and we can able to access this api and uh, we can able to create some good applications it will help uh, many people in order to save some time and money and it's definitely an interesting project so this is all about uh, gpt3 and uh, how to use the open ai we can also use the api uh, in order to build our uh, own application so that is the purpose so here we just uh, gone through the playground here um, they also have the api in order to use it in python and develop our custom application so yes that's all about uh, open ai and this is just a overview and i just explored a few example application you can able to think of these are some pretty common applications but you can able to definitely do some projects on top of this and that's it guys if i have access to open ai codex means uh, i will definitely create a video on that apart from that if this video is helpful to you hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel and share this video to your friends if this is helpful stay tuned for the next video